This is Grumpy Bob and this is Grumpy Bob Reviews. This is part three of Rock and How to Throw Hands. You see what happened in part two. Rock and his only buddy that got in the ring and got it on. So let's take a look at part three. Rock and How to Throw Hands. Grumpy Bob Reviews. Let's take a look. Look at that, look at that. There's no jab throwing, man. Come on, put something into it. Come on. <laughs> look at that. Come on, come on. I want you to hit it with everything you got. Come on, everything you got. Look, look. Oh, 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 oh. Wait a minute. Now, 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 now. I hear the sound of hitting. Ah. Well, well, wait, wake me up when you get started, all right? Oh, man. Oh, man. Get out of here, man. Come on. Look, look. If it's too heavy for you, you know, we can just hang a balloon, all right? All right. You're holding the bag wrong. And you stand there in front mm -hmm. so I can bust your lip like I used to do at Junior High School. Oh, man, you kidding? You know, not only did I beat you, man, man, look, only way I bust my lip was it was chapped. Shoo, chapped. I used to whoop your butt all over the ring. You did go running and boxing. Yeah, yeah, man, you know, That's go, right. go, go, go. not only did I beat you boxing, I beat you at track, football, baseball, basketball, and after school, huh, I got twice as many kisses. Yeah, your mama really loved you. <laughs> no. Hey, how you doing, Mr. Emerson? Hey, James, how you doing, boy? <laughs> Look at you. You know, last time I saw you, you was wearing Scooby-Doo pajamas and had a milk mustache. Hey, hey, look, congratulations. You know, when your father and I was in junior high, we thought we were going to go to the Golden Gloves. Where the hell you been? Well, the locker room was real crowded, Dad. Excuses, excuses. Well, come on, Harold. It's pretty, pretty crowded in here. Get in the ring. Well, Dad, I didn't even get a chance to warm up. Get in the ring. Hey, Dad, I found out that my first bout is with Hector Sanchez. You know, we got a killer left jab, yeah. so I figured maybe we work on some combinations today. Now, look, boy, don't think. Just do what I tell you. You're going to do front work today. That's what's going to keep you from Sanchez's left jab. Tell him, Rock. Well, now, you know, actually, you know, working on putting some pressure on Sanchez and throwing combinations ain't a bad idea. Rob, what do you know about modern training techniques? You just an over the hill, broken down has been that never was. <laughs> or what? Uh, or who? Or where? What? 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 A broken down <laughs> has been that never was. Now I don't want to keep I mean, your you, butt in front of your son. Me? Boy, talk a lot of trash. You talk a lot of trash. You boy, talk a lot of trash. Slow down, girl. I ain't Flo Joe. <laughs> Whoa! Women in tight clothes sweating. It's my favorite show. <laughs> Woo! What you eating that, Joe? Me some ice cream. What flavor is that? Uh, they call this decadent Dutch chocolate. Oh, that's my favorite. With chips. Mmm. You want some? Nah, gotta have willpower. Okay. <laughs> Make it burn. <laughs> and work it out. Make it burn. Give me that ice cream. Oh, give, me, give me ice cream! I don't believe you took my ice cream from me. Messing with me. <laughs> oh, hey, 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 Pop, look out. She gonna blow. Look out, look out! Come on, 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 Look, sweetie pie, happy Valentine's. I got you some chocolates. <laughs> Ooh, chocolate. That's what I needed. He's trying to lose weight. He's trying to lose weight. How'd it go down there at the gym with Harold today? Uh, it went pretty good, you know what I mean? Except Harold's always yelling at the kid. Well, some parents are just screamers, you know. Well, I don't know, you know what I mean? He's always berating the boy, you know, calling him names. A good trainer doesn't do that. Oh, Harold always was a little jerk. Oh, come on, Pop, what are you talking about? What did Harold ever do for you not to like him? When you were growing up, that boy was a bad influence on you. Yeah, every time he was around, you mistreated your brother. Well, I never mistreated Joey. For what? I'll tell you what, if y'all had put one more firecracker down my pants, I swear I was gonna bring you up on charges. Oh, really? <laughs> yeah, you and Harold always brought out the worst in each other. Mm -hmm. Picking on Joey, competing. And then you compete over who was better at picking on Joey. <laughs> oh, come on, Pop. You know, you're exaggerating this whole competition thing. Oh, oh, oh really? Uh, remember that little game y'all used to play called Lose Joey? 
Mm. One time they ditched me in Chinatown for what, like seven hours? <laughs> and then that, that was me. See? Harold's record was only three hours and seven minutes. Yeah. <laughs> I remember Harold did have some kind of sense of humor. I remember he tried to get you to ditch me at our wedding. Oh, come on, sweetheart. But you know I never, ever, ever could have done that, baby. Oh, yeah. It was all that talk about going down to Chinatown for a nightcap. <laughs> Oh, come on, come on, come on. Let's not get sidetracked here. You know, we're talking about James, you know? Look, babe, I think this boy has a good shot, you know? He just needs a better trainer, you know? Someone like, you know, I don't know, uh, you know, like me. <laughs> oh, boy. Here comes that competing thing again. You know something, Pop? Now that I think about it, uh, you tried to ditch me one time, too. <laughs> boy, what are you talking about? Remember that time you got me all dressed up, and you, you took me by the hand, and you led me into this big crowd of uh, kids? Oh, Joey, that was the first day of kindergarten. <laughs> first day of kindergarten. Oh, well, I, sh I should have stayed then, huh? <laughs> <laughs> I, I like you, too. Yeah, I like you. Uh-huh. Yeah, I like you. So, hey, how about you go with me to the TLC concert Friday night? Yo, I'm... Hello? Hey. God! I you told you before. No fun. You talk to your girlfriends after the fight. You ready for the heavy bag? Yes, sir. Let's work it. Stick it hard. All right. I'm going after your gear. Be right back. Hey, hey you look good, Jack. Hey, James. Hey, how you doing, Mr. Emerson? <laughs> My dad will be right back. Hey, well, don't let me stop you now. Well, you got your elbows all out in the air. You trying to hit somebody, you trying to fly like Pat the Bell or something. Come on, let me, let, me, let, me, let me show you how to do this, you know? See, you gotta... Look at Rock, Rock, get in there. Look at Rock. Mr. Emerson, yo, hey! Yeah. Shouldn't I be doing that? Okay, well, you know, you get the idea, right? But you know, elbows in, elbows in and tight. That's it, that's right, tight. Yeah, yeah, okay. Yeah. <laughs> that's it, that's it. Tight, keep them elbows in. Rock. Yeah. What are you doing with my boy's elbows? Well, you know, I'm making sure you keep them in. I'm the boy's trainer. Now, just because you don't have a fight of your own to mess up, don't come in here messing up mine. So you want me to keep him out? Well, I'm not messing a kid up. I'm giving him the advice any good trainer would give him. See there? That's your problem. You are always jealous of me. So I should keep him in. Now, me? why would I be jealous of a guy who single-handedly lost the playground touch football championship game because he missed his block? Well, ain't all out. What am I doing? He's training me here. Yeah, what? yeah, yeah, later. You know, later, later. you know, somehow, if I had James for three days, I could work wonders on him you couldn't work in three years. Oh, don't tempt me, Rob. Oh, you know something? You don't have the guts to give him to me because then you realize what a bad trainer you are. All right, that's it. Maybe this will shut you up. I'm going to give you the boy for three days, mm -hmm. but I want to see him spar before the fight. Okay, okay. We'll see how good a trainer okay, you are. you got it. You got Excuse it. Excuse me, no, do I have a say I mean, in this? No. no. <laughs> right. Here's his gear, okay? You want him? You got it. Okay, all right, all right. Come on, James. Let's work out. Nah, B, I'm hitting the showers. Hey, well, see, look. Come on in, James. Make yourself at home. Oh, okay. <laughs> How come everything's in black and white? Well, you know, the tubes haven't warmed up yet. <laughs> hey, baby, I thought I heard you come in. Hi, sweetheart. <laughs> Hello. Hey, Eleanor, this is James Pearson. This is Harold's boy. Oh, yeah, it's nice to see you. The pleasure's yeah. mine. Right. You look hungry. Why don't you go on in the kitchen and fix yourself something to eat? Eleanor, if the boy ain't hungry, don't make him eat. Oh, I'll force myself. So, Ra, where is Harold? Well, you know, Harold and I have this little competition going. I said I could do a better job of training James, so I'm training him for the next three days. Rock, you promised me you wouldn't get involved with that boxing stuff oh, again. Oh, you know, sweetheart, you know. I guess I ought to thank my lucky stars you and Harold didn't go to the races. Otherwise, now there'd be a horse in my kitchen. <laughs> <laughs> hey, no, but this kid is really something, you know? But Harold doesn't know what he's doing. He's got the boy dancing around like Alvin Ailey. <laughs> uh, I don't know what it is, Harold knows Rock, not. Crazy. All I know is... You better do something about that boy. Oh, well, come on, Eleanor. Look, look, this kid is exactly the same kind of fighter I am, which means that I'd be a better trainer than her could ever be. Rock, the last ring you were in was the one left up in our bathtub. Oh, <laughs> oh come on, sweetheart. 
sweetheart. Come on. It's now. nine o'clock now. Shouldn't he be at home with his father? Well, you know, James is sort of, you know, you know, staying here. <laughs> Rock and lost his mind. Is he sleeping in this house? Well, you know, yeah. <laughs> yeah, Rock, he not sort of staying here. He is staying here. Well, come on, Eleanor. You know, three days. You know, it'll be fun. You know, have, like having a kid around. You know, look at him as your son, you know? <laughs> <laughs> I sure hope James is as good in the ring as he is in the kitchen. I think that boy just knocked out the refrigerator. That was part three of Rock Lord How to Throw Hands. Stay tuned, Grumpy Bot Reviews, part four. Rock Lord How to Throw Hands.